Hey what's up guys welcome back this is Dinesh here and in this video I'll show you what is a toast and how to use a toast in the same video I'll also be showing you what do you mean by the get text method and how to use it by the end of this video this is the output that you'll be getting now if I click on this button which says I am a toast it will show you a small toast okay which is saying I am a toast so guys toast is like a small pop-up message which you can use inside your app to notify users about some important things. So without wasting any time, let's start with the program. So now as you can see, I've basically gone ahead and created an application by the name of ed underscore toast. So just create an application by the name of toast and next I'll delete this hello world text view that is there. After that I'll drag a button component on the screen and I'll give this a name of I am a toast. After that, I'll go inside the text tab and this time below the button ID, I'll set an on click listener and I'll give this a name of toast CLK. So my on click listener method has a name of toast CLK. Next, inside the main activity dot Java file, I'll declare the button. I'll import the class for the button. After that, below the set content view, I'll link the ID to its variable. Now after linking the ID and the variable for the button, next below the onCreate method, I'll declare the toast CLK method. I'll import the view component. Inside this method, I'll now write the code for the toast. That is when the user clicks on the button, it should print a toast. So I'll write down toast dot. So as soon as I type a dot, I'm getting all these suggestions over here. Now out of these, I'll select the first suggestion that is toast dot make text. And inside this round bracket, I need to fill in three parameters. So the first parameter that I need to fill in is I'll type get. So as soon as I type get, the first option that I'm getting is get base context. So I'll select it. Now after that, I'll put a comma and separated by the comma, the second parameter will be the text that you want to display inside the toast. So I'll put two double quotes and I'll type over here, this is a toast message. Now after this double quotes, I'll again put a comma and this time I'll write the third parameter. Now the third parameter stands for the duration, like how many seconds you want to display the toast. You can only set the toast for a length of long or for a length of short. So after this comma, I'll type in toast again, toast dot. And you can see over here, I'm getting two options, length long and length short. So if I select length long, the toast will be displayed for five seconds, or we can say approximately five seconds. And if I select length short, the toast will be displayed for approximately two seconds. So I'll go ahead and select the length long. After this round bracket, I'll again put a dot. And this time I'll choose this method which says show. Now, I basically finished with the code, so I'll go ahead and click on the play button. So now, as you can see over here, my application is loaded. It has a button by the name of I am a toast and this time if I click on this button, you can see over here it is printing out this message. This is a toast message. Now, once you have understood what is a toast, let me show you what do you mean by get text. So in this code only, where I've written toast dot make text, what I'll do is I'll erase the second parameter. And in between these two commas, I'll just write down CLK dot get text. Now, basically what I want to do is I want to show the text of the button inside my toast so to do this, I have used the variable name of the component that is this time the component is the button and I have associated or I have linked it with the get text method. So this get text method will fetch the text from my button and it will show it inside the toast. So guys, just remember whenever you want to fetch a text from the button text view or the edit text, then we have to use this line get text. So once I finish writing this code, I'll again click on the play button. And this time if I click on the button, you can see over here, the message is I am a toast. Okay. Which is the same text for the button. So guys, I hope from this video, you would have understood what is a toast and how to use it. You guys would have also understood what do you mean 
by the get text method and how to use it. So guys, that's it from this video. In the meantime, if you like this video, please feel free to hit the like button 